What's that you got cooking? Apple juice stew with apple juice. Mm, didn't we have that yesterday? Or the no. Yesterday it was baked apple juice with apple juice. And the day before it was fried apple juice. With apple juice. Sorry, I'm doing what I can to switch up our meals. But in my defense, we have a pretty limited set of ingredients. No offense to you. I'm just getting a little bit tired of the apple dews. Well, I, I guess we'll just have to go for another forage, in case we missed anything. Oh, did you have a chance to look at the engine? Yeah. It does seem like it took some damage upon landing, but I should be able to fix that real quick. I also have some good news. What's that? I love you. Oh, with the lights off? Works for me. Uh, no. I didn't do that. Ugh, we must have run out of flow. Weren't you supposed to charge up the nest today? Excuse me if I was working on the engine. I can't do everything. No worries. I'll go get some more outside. If I'm lucky, I'll stumble upon something to spice up the apple juice. Ah, <gasps> I'll come with you. Red. Perfect. Although it seems like one thread won't be enough. No worries, we'll find others. Whoops. Try again. was a bust. We were too slow. No biggie. Plenty of threads out there. How many more do you think we need? I don't know. Three? Maybe four? Good thing there are plenty of flow threads around here. Have you ever seen such a thing? No. Never. Must be an endemic species. And I know it wasn't here yesterday. I mean, 24 hours ago. You know what I'm saying. I wonder if it's edible. Only one way to find out. Yes, you're right. I'll pick up some berries and run some tests. First, we'll need to observe any cutaneous reaction. Then we'll cook them to eliminate bacteria. Mm. It's peppery. You did not. Go ahead. Try it. I'm sure you'll love it. Mm. <coughs> oh, yeah. That is peppery. Lightweight. Off we go. Let's pick these. I'm not sure these will go great with the apple dews. But where there's a meal, there's a way. You know what doesn't go great with apple dews? Apple dews.
Apple juice again. Who knows how long we're gonna be stuck here? We might as well stock up. One or two more threads, and we'll be all set. All right, I'm all charged up. Me too. We can go when you're ready. last us a few days now it's our turn to fill up huh I'm hungry Apple juice stew with apple juice. I can't tell if you're actually excited about this or if you just enjoy seeing me suffer. How long do you think this is gonna last? The flow? Well, if we keep our consumption in check, I think a few days. No, I meant us. Us here. How long until they come get us? Ah. Do we have to talk about this? We are going to need to at some point. We need to be prepared. We need a plan. I'm planning on finishing my plate without hearing about the apiary. Is that okay? Okay. And FYI, you are the one that ruined the mood, not me. I'm wiped. We'll go back out tomorrow. We've already eaten too much. I can never eat too much. We've already eaten too much. I can never eat too much. Okay. I've already eaten too much. You? All right. Let's talk about it. Fine. Uh, I was just gonna ask if you could switch off the light. Oh, 
You've been mulling it over this whole time? Of course I've been mulling it over this whole time. Thank you for adding one more thing to my mind. Hold on, are you telling me you hadn't thought about it before? You know what? No, I hadn't thought about it. I'm trying not to think about the apiary. Enjoy what we have here, even if it isn't much. Um... Do you really think that they can come get us here? If we could take the flow bridge here, then so can they. But there's no way they can know where we are. Is I cut off the autonav, the astrolock? Even the landing was all manual. I'm just saying, let's prepare for the worst. At worst, I kill them. Whoa, you. What? If that's what it takes not to go back, I'll do it. No problem. Kill them, steal their ship. By the time they send more guys, we'll be far away. You're seriously not considering... Maybe not. Maybe I am. At worst, we'll know. You're scaring me. <laughs> oh, come on. You're totally safe. You're my teddy bear. I'm not sure how I should take this. <laughs> well, take me in your arms for a start. You aren't dressed yet? I put on my pajamas. I mean, to get out. Well, see, I was just wondering, do we have to get out? Can't we just hang in the nest for once? Lounge around, read a book, watch a movie? We don't have movies. Right, sure, but you know what I mean. Come on, the weather's great. But the weather is always great. For now, who knows, tomorrow could be the beginning of the long winter months. It could last for years. One more reason to stock up on apple juice. Mm. You know, always being right is not necessarily a good quality. On the contrary, many people find it very unappealing. You? Not sure. Do you need anything? No. Huh. Me neither. Hey, you never told me. What did your mate look like? Uh, I don't know. Didn't you get her file from the matchmaker? Yeah, I did. But I never really looked at it. Seriously? You're not even curious? Well, no. I already knew you. <laughs> Whatever. Come on, we'll look at it together. If you wish. Huh. Oh. oh, any other pictures? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. She's kind of cute. You think so? Yeah, definitely. Don't you? I don't know. Too much makeup, I think. I like a more natural look. Like you. Mm -hmm. Do you really think I'm not wearing any kind of makeup right now? Um... <laughs> Come on, let's check her profile instead of this foolishness. Let's see... Interests. Reading, music, having a drink with my friends. Whoa. Do you think you can handle such a strong personality? <laughs> That's harsh. Job. Ocean Biology Research Assistant at the University of Ox. Huh. Okay. Looks like you two are made for each other. No one is made for each other. That's the kind of rhetoric the matchmaker uses. Yeah. Yeah, I know. But it still looks to me like that was a bleeding good pick. You'd make a great couple. Might have made. There's a difference. Uh, tell me. Are you really wearing makeup right now? <laughs> we spend every waking minute together in the nest. If I discreetly slipped into the bathroom every morning to put on some eyeliner, don't you think you'd notice? <laughs> yeah, at least I think. But you're not really answering my question, though. I know.
Do you remember where the apple dews were? Can we try and pick something else for a change? Shaking. It's shaking. It's shaking a lot. Is it over? Seems like it. A anything broken? No. No, I don't think so. Well, except... <sighs> it's not all lost. Well, it is a bit. Look, we can always search the islet, try and find a way to get to the other side. Such as? I, I don't know. A, a rope. A jetpack. Spring-loaded shoes. Anything. And if we don't find it? If we don't find... Uh, I don't know. That's why we'll have to find something. Okay. I, uh... I think I found something. Huh? Call me crazy. But this looks like a bluten? Yep, it looks like a flow bridge. Kind of like the one we took to get here, but smaller? Is that possible? Why not? We still don't really know how the flow bridges work in space, but if the phenomenon can happen on a macro scale, then why not on this one? If there can be flow between two planets, why not two bits of a planet? Okay. If this really is a flow bridge, I'm not sure what we're waiting for. What? Flow bridges are linking one place to another, right? So this one definitely leads someplace. Wait, y you want to just get on there without knowing where it goes? It goes elsewhere. I think that's as good a start as any. Huh. Um... Do we have everyone, okay? Here. <laughs> then we're good. Looks like we're on another islet. Yeah. The bridge seems to be a link between the islets. If there are any others like this, we may be able to get back to the nest. Do you see what I'm seeing? Uh, a big ugly lizard? No. The mushrooms on its back. Looks like a type of hygrocybrubicins. Ah. Is that good news? Like... Can we eat it? Oof. Not at all. Unless you're looking for a quick way to unload your kidneys. But don't you find that symbiosis amazing? The movements of the lizard are helping spread the spores. As far as what the lizard is gaining, I'll have to study that closer. Maybe it doesn't even know. Maybe we should tell it. No way. You don't get in the way of Mother Nature's plans. I'll make sure I remember that next time you have salad stuck in your teeth. Have you ever seen such a thing? No, never. Must be an endemic species. I wonder if it's edible. Only one way to find out. Yes, you're right. I'll pick up some berries and run some tests. First, we'll need to observe any cutaneous reactions. Then we'll cook them to eliminate bacteria. Mmm. It's peppery. You did not. Go ahead. Try it. I'm sure you'll love it. Mm. <coughs> oh, yeah. That is peppery. Lightweight. Off we go. Let's pick these. I'm not sure these will go great with the apple dews, but where there's a meal, there's a way. 
You know what doesn't go great with apple dews? Apple dews. Seems like our mini flow bridge worked. Wow. That's actually... What is that? We should take a closer look. Any idea what's underneath our feet, Mr. Geologist? I'm a biologist. Isn't that the same thing? Biology, the living. Geology, the rocks. And what makes you think this is not living, pray tell? Uh, it looks like a dust deposition. Some kind of rust. And it looks like this kind of rust is particularly sensitive to flow. What? Look beneath your feet. Oh, there's vegetation underneath. It was probably smothered. Good thing we came this way. Wait, we can... That way, look. It looks like the rust has formed into a bigger chunk. Even the apple dew shrubs are completely covered. I hope this one will yield some nice and juicy fruit to thank us. Be careful. These creatures don't seem to be in their right mind. I did notice that. All right, that's it. Believe that. One of them is weak. We should be able to pacify it. Copy that. Well done. It settled down. Now's the time. Bye bye. One to go. Bam! Chill. Target left. Big way. He's fighting back. We may need to change our strategy. This one's ready. I got this. There you go. The end. Another flow bridge. That's great. It means there must be others. If we're lucky, they'll bring us back to the nest. I thought this planet was supposed to be a desert. Deserted. Not a desert. According to the archives, a colonization plan had been considered by the Apiary, with Exanova as the main provider. But the planet was eventually classified as inhospitable. Let me guess. High seismic activity? I don't know. The file doesn't say anything about that. Hmm. I hope we don't have any more unpleasant surprises. My batteries are empty. Mine too. We need to find a flow thread. Don't be scared. We're just trying to take a closer look at you.
like my attacks aren't landing. Maybe if we both attacked at the same time. I think we found the right technique. Ha! I'm sure he felt that. For the picking. Harvest time. Kapow! Who's next? Who's next? Boba nuts? Aren't we the lucky ones? Uh, what are they? You've never heard of boba nuts? They're one of the most nutritious nuts. 25% carbohydrates, 50% protein, 75% lipids. That adds up to 150%. Precisely. A great mystery of modern science. You're pulling my leg, aren't you? Maybe. But once you have a taste of my boba salad, you will forget all about it. One down. Target left. Ah! Are you all right? You? Yep, saw that. Can't take much more of this. That looks bad. Are you okay? Shielding. Perfect. Okay.
turn. Yep. I'm uh, are you all right? This one's ready. On it. Done and done. That was easy. Chicken. And just like that guys, we've come to the end of this video. Hope you enjoyed the content. If you did, hit that like button. And if you didn't, smash it twice to tell me how angry you are. Don't forget to pop the subscribe button as well as ring the bell icon to get notified of any future videos. Oh, and uh, check this little video out. You can also subscribe over here. And this video is pretty cool too.